Welcome to the Matriarchal Facilitator. I have a message from the Lord on today, and that message is light of the world. Let's pray. Father God, come before your throne of grace and mercy, Lord God. Lord God, we just say we love you, O oh Lord, on today, O oh Lord. Lord, thank you, Lord God, for positioning us, Lord God, to be the light of the world, Lord God. Lord, we do not take this lightly, O oh Lord, and we'll be so ever careful to give you all the honor, all of the praise, and all of the glory, Lord God. Lord God, thank you for your son, Jesus, Lord God, who ransomed us from our sins, O oh Lord, who paid the price, Lord God, with his shed blood oh lord lord i decrease and i allow you to increase have your way oh lord and lord we pray for ukraine and russia on today oh lord we're asking lord god that your hand be upon all of your people in jesus name i pray amen light of the world Matthew 5, 14, you are the light of the world, like a city on a hilltop that cannot be hidden. We have Psalm 18, 28, you make my lamp bright. The Lord, my God, lights my darkness. Micah 7 and 8, do not have joy over me, you who hate me. When I fall, I will rise. Even though I am in darkness, the Lord will be my light. We have John 1 and 5. That light shines in darkness, yet the darkness did not overcome it. John 9 and 5. As long as I am in the world, I am the light of the world. John 8 and 12. Then Jesus spoke to them again. I am the light of the world. Anyone who follows me will never walk in darkness, but will have the light of life. On today... If you are a follower of Christ, you have the light of Christ inside of you. There's no darkness. You have the power to put away all darkness because you are in Christ. Put away that darkness today. Whatever it's saying to you, whatever it's trying to say to you, whatever it's trying to steal from you, Put it away on today. Trust the Lord to lead you in greater knowledge, greater understanding, greater fellowship, greater ability to deal with your brothers and sisters on day-to-day -day basis and within your home to be able to deal with the things going on in your home on today. The Lord wants to be your light. He is your light, your guiding light. Let him guide you into all truth. You are the light of the world. Let the Lord use your light on today. I pray that you would allow him to illuminate you to the world so that they can see the goodness that he has stored within you. I pray this message blesses you, but more so, I pray that it builds you up in your most holy faith. And you trust the Lord on today to lead and guide you. Until we see each other again, thank you and be blessed.